Hi, my name is Athena and I'm going to be reviewing Frankie's bikinis today. I ordered quite a few. There's actually a few more that are in my drawers, but um, I mostly ordered the tie-dye ones because that's the only things I personally felt were worth the money. It was kind of difficult ordering too just because when I was looking at reviews, there weren't really reviews for more medium-sized bodies, only like super skinny or super big. So yeah, I'll get into it. So this is the first one. This is the um, Oliver Bottom and Nicola Top in Aqua. Um, I got a size large in both of them just because I found they run really small and they're extremely cheeky, which isn't really my preference, but I didn't find that they had any that weren't. Um, it has a really velvety feel too, but I haven't really tried these in the water. It's also super low cut, which you would definitely have to shave you know would definitely get annoying over time but overall i think it's pretty cute the color is really stunning and yeah i would give this about like an 8 out of 10. the only thing too is that it actually smells really strong from the dye that they probably used so just be aware of that if you were to get it so this is the second one it's the same it's the same style it's the nicola top and the oliver bottom in the color violet um, like the other one, it's super cheeky, which might, you know, if it isn't your favorite, they don't really offer other ones in these type of styles. But I think overall it's pretty cute. It still has a velvet feeling like the other one, but this one doesn't smell as much. Um, it's not the highest wasted, but overall I think it's still pretty good. I don't know if it's really worth the money that you can probably get similar ones at different places, but overall I like it. I think, I think I would definitely keep it. So this is the Briar Bottom in the color Emerald, I believe, and yeah, this is the Brian Briar Bottom in the color Tide in a large, and this is the Geo Top in a large. This was also super, super cheeky, and overall it doesn't really have, the, it feels pretty soft, but it's not really, I'd say, anything crazy. Um, the top I felt was kind of... Like it would fall off really easily so i had to tie it from the back as you can see because otherwise it kind of just here i'll show you it kind of just stays flat especially if you were to like run or do exercises in the sun or at the beach or pool or anything you would definitely have a girl popping out i think it's really cute i don't really think it's really worth the money this one you could definitely get something similar like forever 21 or pack sun or something but I saw, I think it was Charlie D'Amelio wearing this. I thought it looked really cute, but I like the bottoms a lot more than the top. I don't think it's really supportive if you have bigger girls, but you know, it's cute. So this is the Tasha top in the emerald color, you know, color tide in a size large. And these are the briar bottoms in a large in a tie, the same ones I was wearing before. Um, I think this one looks a lot better. It feels a lot softer than the velvet ones, I would say, and it definitely feels a lot more supportive than the Geo Top. I think the colorway is definitely cute, the matching. Um, I would definitely recommend this. I think it's really cute, and especially with the bottom since they're high-waisted, it doesn't look like you're trying to cover too much skin, but it's still, you know, flattering. I'd definitely recommend it. I think it's really cute. I do think it runs small, though, because I'm usually a medium in bathing suits and I had to go large for this one and even then I still feel it, like it's a little small especially the bottoms so I would definitely size up if you were to get these so out of all the ones I've had I think this is my least favorite I think the bottoms which are the Ryan bottoms in the color funfetti in a size medium and the top is the Tasha top in a size medium in the color funfetti as well I think they don't the bottom runs a little too big and it's kind of an unflattering fit. I feel like it wouldn't really be supportive if you were to swim or just do any activities. But I think the top is cute. Um, yeah, I wouldn't really recommend the bottom. I feel like these are super uncomfortable, kind of, and the cheekiness is just not my favorite. I feel like it would give really weird tan lines. But I like the top. I think it's cute. As a set, it would probably be cute, but you know, I don't really think this would be supportive. So my last ones are these. This is the Tasha top in a size large, and these are the reed bottoms in a size large in the color, 
actually don't remember, but I'll put it in the link below. I think this is super cute. I think this is the most flattering one out of all of them. I think the V-line really does justice and you could definitely make it a lot higher rise if you'd like to cover, you know, more skin. Um, I think it's super cute. The only thing is that these don't really make this any smaller. The little tie things, I guess it's just for decoration. But overall, I think the bottoms are really, really flattering. The top, of course, it's not going to be super supportive or anything, but I've definitely worn this to the beach and it stayed on. I didn't really have to adjust it that much. And I don't think the tan lines come out super crazy. So I would definitely recommend it. I think it's super cute. I'm not sure if they sell this style anymore since I got it secondhand, but I think it's really cute. I think it's definitely my favorite one out of all of them. It's not overly cheeky, you know, it covers enough. It's super flattering. And yeah, I would definitely recommend it. So that's my review on Frankie's bikinis. I think they were super expensive, but also super cute. So it's whether you're willing to pay for it. I think the tie dye, the quality is pretty good. I think it would just, it would last for a while, but you know, hundred dollars each, it's a lot of money. But overall, I think it was pretty cute. Um, thank you for watching. You can subscribe if you like, and that's all. I hope this was helpful.